it's all it's all smooth sailing from there. Think about this. That's the hard part, though. I if you go to any college anywhere in the world, right, and you meet ten college students and you say, yeah. "Hey, what are you taking?" Well, I'm, I'm I'm taking political science right now, but I'm thinking of switching to marketing. Um, you were told that if you didn't go to college, you would never amount to anything. Okay, mm -hmm. then you get to college. And you're taking these classes because you were told you had to go here anyway. Right. But you don't really know what you want to do and don't know who you are. So at the end of the day, you end up with a degree that you can't use. Doesn't mean anything. Because you don't know what the fuck you want to do. Right? And, then, and the worst part is, Dana, is, is in the last 10 years, the people who are coming out are not just coming out with the useless degree. They're coming out with $120,000 of debt that on their shoulders that they're not able to pay off. Yep. Because they're not able to. Is a college degree requirement to work here? Yeah, no, probably for the better. I want, I want gritty, raw talent, tough, regardless. Talented people, yeah. exactly. That are willing to work, and and uh, I, I'm I'm telling you, I'm so lucky to have the team that I have. We. I but that's the hardest thing is hopefully you're helping people do that here is figure out who you are. As you, you said, figure out who you are, and then and then don't listen to anybody. But that's what I think so many people, including young people, are struggling with today is how, how do I go about figuring out who I am when I'm conditioned to believe something that I'm taught it's about myself. That's the key. It's the key to life. You yeah. truly want to be happy? You know what I mean? I posted this thing yesterday. Create a life that you can't wake, to, wake up to every day, you know? Mm. And, and that is, in a nutshell, me. I can't, I Create can't a wait life, to get say out it again. Create a life that you... Can't wait to wake up to every Can't day. wait to wake up to. I love that. You know what I mean? Yes. <laughs> That's good. You seem, you seem like the kind of guy who fits that. I, I think we have more in common than I knew about. Oh, I could tell the yeah. minute I, I saw you and heard you and everything else. And um, yeah, love what you're doing. Congrats on, with Thank your you, success. Man. And Thank uh, you. We'll figure out, on my side, we'll figure out what's coming up next. I mean, it's going to be saving, helping this country in whatever way I can. But whether you're an entrepreneur in politics, not just about whatever it is, fighting, business, being a teacher, a volunteer, whatever it is, figuring out who you are is the hardest part. But once you got that, nobody's going to stop you from achieving the maximum of your potential. That's exactly and right. And, and if you your do story's all about. become vice president, president someday, it's about unifying this country, making people proud again to be American and helping American citizens to do better. It's just, that that's that's the way I look at it. And you know the, the piece of advice you gave at the level of the individual, figure out who you are, it's the same advice to our nation. So true. Let's figure well, out who we are 100%. as Americans. It means that we're exceptional. It means that we believe we can achieve anything we want with our own hard work and commitment and dedication. Right now, that's what we're going through as a country. Every other country, you say from China to, to India to other countries, you name Australia, that are proud of who they are. Right now, it's almost like we have forgotten who we are. Figure that out. It's almost the advice to a young person that you give is the same advice I would give to the country. Figure out who you are. And then don't listen to what anybody else from the media to another country tells you to the UN that tells you what you're supposed to do. Figure out who you are. Don't listen to anybody and follow your actual purpose. And that's what it's going to be for our country as well. 100%. You know who we are? 